The whole reason this is happening is because people won't protect themselves, Tony. I mean, what are you thinking? Then why did you leave your house when when you had COVID? I mean, you had it and you left your house. I mean, it's been documented. First right? of all, so it has been documented. My ass, it's been documented. Why I quarantined. Why, why I went out. It? My wife got accosted by somebody. I don't know, man. You're and I, I know you don't know, so I'm trying to help you. The science is clear, Tony. You're trying to help me. You're I don't want you, you to get sick <laughs> the way I was the sick. The science is clear. Oh, you care about me all of a sudden, huh? Enough to have you on the show. <laughs> hey, that line reminds me of Pepsi, man, right there. When he says, ah, oh, you, you, you care about me all of a sudden. Oh, you care about me all of a sudden, huh? <laughs> Enough. To... <laughs> the way I was the saying. science is clear. Oh, you care about me all of a sudden, huh? Enough to have you on the show because I don't like people uh, making bad decisions for themselves and their family. I was hoping it was a little bit of a stunt. Oh. You have the freedom not to take the vaccine. Well, I just don't ask... know why you think it's a good move. Maybe, uh, maybe we should ask your brother about pr protecting people, right? I hey, mean, look, that's his job. Uh, and if he doesn't no, do it well, whole, people won't whole, vote for him. That's a whole new can of worms. But don't, look, Tony, look, I don't Listen, know if you know me too well. My, I'm not shy away my from stand much. is not I'm a political you about stand. You. Yeah, good. I appreciate that, too, because I know you talk a lot. So, so my, my stance here is a pro-freedom stand only. It's not political. You're never going to... If you come down here, you're not going to see a Trump flag flying over the roof, okay? You're not going to see campaign signs. You're not going to see campaign slogans or political slogans ever, okay? Mm -hmm. You're only going to see pro-freedom fr messages, and that's it. Um, and you're not going to drag me d down the hole talking about the science. It's, this is not about whether I'm pro-vaccine or not. I'm pro freedom anti tyranny okay and uh, you know may maybe the conversation should really be between me and your brother that that's what i'm thinking maybe so you're pro freedom but people can't wear masks tony it doesn't make sense it really doesn't i gave you a chance to make the case i wish you well i hope your family stays safe i made my case you didn't have much to say you didn't have much to say i mean so I honestly you sound like an idiot so there's not much to say but tony good luck with it see you and so do you yeah I, so do you. only for having you on the show that was my only mistake I like the guy. I like the restaurant owner. More people should be like that guy. This was during the Sniffles 19. And his restaurant was saying, if you wear a mouth diaper or, you know, if you're, you know, jabberino, you're not welcome here. I respect that. And to say it in that moment, you know, it's very easy to say that now. But he said that when, when it counted. And that's why this guy deserves respect. And this guy really does not deserve that much respect at all. He's now, you know, changing his mind. But, uh, you know, it's uh, a little too late, man.